So today I decided to buy a couple of 501st Battle Packs and see what alternate builds I could come up with. And the results were pretty cool. Okay, so using only these two sets, I came up with two models of like the five, 501st vehicles that I think are pretty good. So the first thing I wanted to show you guys was the four-legged walker I came up with. Now, it's not super sturdy, but it looks kind of cool. has two stud shooters, the front panel moves, and has a little control panel for the driver. And like comfy seats with these grill pieces, a uh, little holster clip for his gun. And it can fit two other guys with mounted cannons and a little flag back here. Some binoculars. It's pretty cozy. It's got some armor plating. Won't protect you from much, though. It's not that strong. And, oh, another thing I wanted to say was I didn't use the speeders for these sets. I literally just only took apart the walkers. These can just be on their own. That was my little version of making the challenge harder. And the second one I used, or... Freaking, the second vehicle I built was this little, like, hovercraft thing. With two thrusters on the bottom, and it has this main cannon. It's got some plating, and a little control panel, little, little antennas, clip for his gun, and a clip for some binoculars. And, uh, also the only pieces that weren't from these sets was this clip, Technic clip piece on all of the bigger cans just because I think it looks more accurate than the candlestick piece so anyway kind of cool